Yeah, good morning. I decided to do my live early this morning. So for those of you who don't know me, I am Sophie. I am a very busy homeschooling mom, looking after my dad and building an online business in affiliate marketing. I'm trying to share my journey here on this uh, YouTube uh, on this um, uh, Facebook page, uh, share with you my ups and downs and also my, my tips and tricks and things that I try, that work, that don't work, that help me along the way. Um, and today I wanted to talk about goals. I realized that it's much, much easier to achieve something if you set clear goals if you, you you just need to know where you want to go what you want to to be doing in order to get there i was particularly struck by something i i, I did in 2018 i'll tell you a little story i love reading i, I really i just love reading um, but life takes over because I'm busy and, and uh, I found that as the years went by and I got more and more busy, I was reading fewer and fewer books. And I don't, uh, it bothered me. I want to be reading regularly because I like it. I find it, it, it's good for my brain. It's good for all sorts of things. So in 2018, I decided to set a goal for myself. I decided to decide on a number. And I thought, okay, I need to be reading one book a month. So by the end of the year, I'll have read a minimum of 12 books. And, you know, that really helped me. I actually read more than one book a month. I ended up reading 18 books, I think, in 2018. And I am pretty sure I achieved this because I had this this figure somehow, this number, one book per month. And I've noticed that it works like that with many things. I don't know if you've noticed, but they say eat five pieces of fruit or vegetables per day. They don't just say eat healthy, eat fruit and vegetables. Well, they do, but it helps to have this figure of five a day. Um, they say the same about steps. You know, they say if you do 10,000 steps a day, you you okay kind of thing. And I find it, it makes it easier. It makes it more, more, more real if you can have a number, have, a, have something clear that you are aiming for. And the one book a month for me really helped me. And it helped me read not only one book a month, but more than one book a month. If I do the steps, it helps me too. If I, if I set myself to do 10,000 steps a day, I usually exercise, do a lot more exercise than if I don't have this figure in my head. And I think really the same thing goes for business. And one of the things that helps me in my very busy schedule, in my very busy days, one of the things that really helps me move forward is setting very clear goals. If if I, I I really try to have one thing I need to have done every day, and it can be something very simple, um, but I try to have at least one thing. Usually, it's more, but you know, I try to I try not to stay vague. I try to be precise. I'm not only thinking I have to be moving forward and taking action every day. I am setting exactly what it is that I need to be doing. Today, well, now every day I need to do a Facebook Live. And every day I have, apart from that, a set, a list or a set of steps or a, a points of things that I need to have done by the end of the day. That definitely helps me move forward. And I do believe it will help me have success in the long run. So I hope this was helpful. I wish you a good day. And I will be back tomorrow for more. <laughs> Bye.